this company is literally firing on all cylinders. And I still don't think they're telling everybody about what they have in the bag and, and what they, uh, and what they don't. Sorry. Yeah. What things they have in the bag they haven't talked about. Yeah. I mean, look, I just, I do the math really simply, you know, 115 billion in, in custom AI chips by 29. Uh, we think Broadcom gets 80% of that revenue. So, you know, they're at, five billion a quarter now of ai chip and networking specifically and so you know we think there's a massive amount of upside from here for the company and so we're, we've been very clear you heard my argument it was simulated but i meant everything i said about the growth of xpus and what these large hyperscalers are going to do um, and i think it's just getting started and i think while we're seeing declining growth rates for for gpus by the way, against a very large number, I'm not saying it's not a very large number. It is. Uh, you're going to actually see acceleration of growth rates against a smaller number, but people love a growth story. So the growth here is palpable. 